Big Phil here for the United Hour. And today was Super Sunday, the last day of the Premier League where all the fixtures are played at the same time. But I kind of focused on like maybe three fixtures today. Our game, which ended 2-0 two, two to us. I'm focusing, having a little up along. Arsenal versus Everton and Manchester City versus West Ham United. Anyway, let's get to, let's get this all the way. Congratulations to Manchester City for doing the four peat. Four successive titles. Something that Manchester United have not done. But hey, we are country miles behind Manchester City. So congratulations to them. Right? Final game of the season for our game now. Rasmus Hoyland scored. Diego Dallo scored. We said some farewells today to possibly Johnny Evans. I hope he is gone. Rafael Varane is going. Casemiro? Who knows? Bruno Fernandes? Who knows? Um, Tony Martial, definitely gone for sure. Christian Eriksen? Who knows, right? Today was the final fixture, final game for some of these Manchester United players. But hey, that's the end of the English Premier League season. Manchester City are champions. I literally do not know what position we finished. Did we finish 8th or 7th? I do not know, right? But this is a season to forget. This was an absolute shit show. A season, this is probably Manchester United's worst season in what? 20, 30, 40 years? Who knows? Right? But we have to do some serious open heart surgery this summer. Right? The first thing we have to fix is that midfield. Fix that midfield. I don't care if we sign about 10 players. If we sign 10 players, I want about three or four of them to be potential midfielders or experienced midfielders. Right? Midfielders that got a brain. The current midfielders, we got Scott McTominay, Bruno Fernandez. They ain't got no brain at all. Oh, yeah, I totally forgot. Today was Sofian Amrabat's last day. Um, sorry, last EPL fixture for Manchester United. Will he feature in the FA Cup final, which I will get onto in a sec? Who knows? Right? But. Back to what we need to do this summer. We need to perform open heart surgery on this team because this team was an absolute shit show. I cannot think of any time this season where we perform well. We've had moments to remember Liverpool um, coming to Old Trafford for the FA Cup and, you know, 4 3 to us. Um, I can't think of anything else, honestly. But. Some of these players need to be ashamed of themselves that they put on the shirt this season, right? Now, on to the FA Cup. Hopefully, hopefully most of our players are fit and raring to go because this is the chance of winning silverware this season. Will Manchester United lift the FA Cup this season based on how we are playing? Hell to the no. But... There's still a chance. There's still a chance. There's a very slim chance. But hey, we got to see which Manchester United turn up on the day. Right? But hey, Eric Ten Hag, I end on this note. Eric Ten Hag, you have your work cut out for you this upcoming transfer window, this upcoming summer. Right? Because, I'm going to say it right now, Eric Ten Hag, I want you sacked if you do not turn it around by this year, December. If you have not made any significant changes throughout the course from the beginning of the 2024-2025 season to December, sack him. Okay? And I will end on that note. <sighs> on to the FA Cup. Let's see. Manchester Derby again. Congratulations to Manchester City again. But can we start them from lifting the FA Cup? Who knows? 